Hey guys, welcome back. It's Ely here, and today we're going to talk about controlling our drones. Drone control. As you can see, this is our tutorial city from build, thrive, survive tutorial. We're still in our founder stage. We can't add any more humans to the planet. This is after launch. I've waited a little bit to record a tutorial, make sure I had the best stuff out there for you guys to learn with, as opposed to some ad hoc stuff. Let's dive in. So the purpose of this tutorial is to talk about drone control. So during the time over on Twitch with live stream, some of the comments and questions were, how do I do X? How do I do Z? If you double click, it should always take you to where your drone is. Let's speed this up. We're on three. This guy should be on a transport route. It's going to scoop up these things and it's going to take them back. Let's look at how we did that. I'm going to interrupt it. And in fact, I'm going to make it. I'm going to make it come all the way back to here. Couple things. If you scroll out, you could then scroll in to a particular part of your map, right? Scroll out and then scroll in. That's handy. So we're going to bring this drone back. There's a couple ways you could do it. So with your transport drone highlighted, you have all kinds of controls, right? You've got load resources, unload resources, and create transport route. So with our guy highlighted, we're gonna do a couple of things. I'm gonna scroll out because that deposit was a bit over here. I can simply click load resource and click on the ground, tell it all, and that drone's gonna come here and it's going to grab all of that stuff. I'm gonna take care of this leaky pipe here in a second. Now we're no longer losing oxygen and water. Back to that redundancy piece. So now this drone's gonna come here, load this stuff up. But what we can do, instead of doing that, we could do a transport route, tell it to do the same, but instead of waiting for it to load, it's gonna automatically bring that stuff right back to our depots. So now it's gonna do that for us. When that's done, it's gonna come back, drop it off and go back out if it has to. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy, right? There, now we've got that done. these guys your RC rover this controls a lot of your little tiny drones and this helps you expand and build past certain places where you normally wouldn't a couple of tips with this I've recalled all of my little drones as it says and if I needed to, I could tell this guy to go charge something else. In fact, I think we have this guy over here that probably needs a charge. So let's do this. Now that drone is going to drive all the way over here and recharge this guy. Perfect. And here comes our delivery. It scooped up all of that stuff. And now it's gonna make a delivery. And there it goes. It's charging off the grid, which is perfect. And then it's gonna dump. Although, do we have enough room for metal? We might not have enough room for the metal. So, let's fix this. B for your build menu? Oh no. We have an enthusiast. Nice. Good job. Good job becoming an enthusiast. Okay, so let's toss down... Oh, that's rare metal. I want regular metal. Let's do regular metal. And 
And now let's place that regular metal right there. Cool. So we did have enough space, but we won't have enough space in the future. Interesting. So in this case, I want to take I want to take this stuff load it up. I want to make a deposit, a depot. Deposit depot schmepo. I'm going to tell it to drop that stuff. And what is this? Electronics? I don't have enough space for electronics? What on earth did I do? How did I get all of this stuff? All of my other builds are screaming for this stuff. How did I... What did I do to deserve all of this? Please tell me. I'd like to know. Now, I could have, instead of being impatient, let those drones do that movement. They would have done it. Looks like we need polymer. Dang. Dang it. And see how they... Boop, 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 boop. Right? Now they're doing stuff for us. That guy's charging up on the grid, and it's going to add more to our depots. So as long as you have this something close for them to charge with, obviously we haven't researched all of the good stuff yet, but as long as your power lines are within range, uh, that can finally take off, but there's nothing I could put on it because I don't have the raw metals yet, right? Or the rare metal. And that could take off. Let's take off. So again, right-click to tell the drone to go somewhere. Let's find more stuff. Can we pick up more stuff on the ground? If you left-click, it'll tell you, give you that option. If you left-click on the object, it should just farm the object and then deliver it here. If you double click, it'll take you to that drone. So if you double click these guys, let's look at something else. If I place a metals depot down, open these guys, it's going to mine all of this. This guy, let's go scan something. Simple right click to scan. This would be your RC Explorer. And so now what this is going to let us do is it's going to let us take this guy, tell it load these, back out, and deposit them. I think we're here. Oh look, an anomaly found. So now that, that transport's gonna make its way all the way over here, scoop this up, take it back. And because we did a, a transport route, it's gonna scoop up what it can, take it back, come back, take it back, come back, take it back. Meanwhile, these guys are gonna continue mining this. There it goes on its way back. Let's scan this guy. Okay, so it did make its way back. Other things to control with your drones. You can actually tell these guys to move somewhere. But more importantly, tell them where to belong. 
Now I'm currently playing vanilla. I know there's a bunch of mods that have just hit. I can't wait to see what they're all going to do and how they're going to change. In fact, I plan to do a series where we're playing with the mods, where we look at the mods. So that's that that mess is done. If I move this guy here, it might reach this to dump it there. Yes. In fact, if I move it ever so slightly more. Nope, just, just, ooh. Nice. I think that concludes our drone discussion, how to control them, some various things we could do with them. With your shuttles, they work very much like your other drones. As long as there's something within range, they're going to go grab it, move it to somewhere else. Until next time, my name is Azili. Thanks for watching. If you found this episode handy, please like and subscribe. Don't forget, you can check me out five days a week on Twitch. Twitch.tv slash Azili. Links down below. Thanks again for watching. Stay awesome. Stay amazing.